Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day today. So happy to have you back. If you're new here, hi! My name is Jen. If you're returning, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping back. I appreciate all of you so very much. You leave the best comments. Um, I have the best followers and the best viewers. I, I just love you guys so much. You always are so uplifting. I very rarely get rude comments. There's a there's a few every once in a while, but I, I really appreciate you guys. From the bottom of my heart, know that. I appreciate every single one of you so much. Okay, so we're doing a Timu haul today, of course. And, well, I mean, what else would we do, right? <laughs> so I think I got some a pretty different mishmash of things here. Um, a little bit longer than the last haul, maybe about a half hour or so. And uh, I say we just get right into it. Please check my description box for links. Um, I will put my uh i have an influencer number with timu but i don't really use that so i don't know but i'll put all that stuff in the in the box below uh so yeah i don't know but anyways let's just see what i got and see how decent it is that's the one thing i like uh that's one reason i kind of started doing videos about timu was because i like to know the quality of things if it's good if it's bad you know are people going to tell me the truth i'm here to tell you the truth if i think things suck i'll let you know <laughs> I also have a tendency to buy the same things over and over and over because once you find something good, like I got to have it in every color, every, you know, all the things. So, okay, got these glasses from Timu. They were my last haul. I'm going to wear them today. Uh, this cardigan is also from Timu. This necklace is from Timu. This tank top is from Timu. I didn't, I didn't put any earrings in. My nails are from Timu. So yeah, we are all Timu'd out today. Let's get right into this. Okay. Wow, these are a little stronger prescriptions, so I might have to switch glasses because it's like, whoa. Okay, I have hauled these nails before. I'm a nail... I, I probably have a set of nails in every single haul video that I do, um, but I've bought these several times. These were $2.98 this time when I bought them. Um, they, the price tends to fluctuate, of course, with everything else on, on Timu. Oh, one last thing I wanted to mention. I have talked about Timu Circle before, and I do pay for that, and I think it's worth it, but I find, I've been talking to, like, other people, and they don't get the same benefits as me, and it's all kind of different. So I hate to go over it with what I get from Timu Circle and have you guys not get the same things as me, so I almost don't even want to bring it up again. I will tell you that I subscribe it's like a membership and and i get two free items a month and then once i spend a certain amount i get a percentage back which i claim and then i still get price adjustments and honestly i usually use my price adjustment money to pay for my timu circle membership so i don't know i guess it kind of works out either way but i hate to tell you what i get because it's different than everybody else. Like this month, I had a whole bunch of stuff going on in there. Like I, I'm claiming a daily prize. But anyways, check it out. Um, if you don't know what it is, go in your app, go to your account, go to Timu Circle and see what's in there. Um, I, I feel like it's different for everybody. So I can't really tell you what you're going to get because I don't know. Anyways, back to these nails. Okay, these were $2.98 in the style Smooth Surface <laughs> E225, but I've showed these before. This is what they look like. They're really, really pretty. They're like an almond shape nail. They come in different colors. Um, I may even have another set in this bag, but I absolutely love these. Like, I love the color of them. They're like a baby pink mauve kind of color and then the other three are like a metallic kind of color they're really nice very well made for 2.98 uh, i mean yeah very very well made for 2.98 you get 24 nails now you don't get any do you get glue with these i don't even know i've never even opened up a package of these hold on well actually i have i shouldn't say that but i usually use my own glue so I don't even know what comes in here because I, I always do my own glue. Hold on. Okay, so just so you know, you do get the glue tabs in here. You also get a nail file. I've actually been using the glue tabs, but I'm not a big fan of the glue tabs because I don't feel like they hold the nails on very well. But yeah, this is kind of like the colors of the nails. Um, but yeah, I really like these. Um, the They're very good quality. They're a really nice size. Uh... And you do get the glue, so yeah, it's well worth the 2.98. 
Okay, next is a garden item. I paid $4.07 for this. It's like a flag stand. Um, I have bought these off of Amazon before for way more than $4.07. Usually like around 10 bucks a piece. But I really like these, you know. Let me open this up. They're metal. Uh, it's just a metal little like garden flag holder type of thing. Um, but I really like these. They're very, very well made. Again, four bucks is like, that's crazy for these, right? So you, you put your flag across here and then you get like this little strap, which I love because you put it, you're, you're going to put it like on the, what do I want to call this? The side and it holds your flag in place so that your flag stays, you know, situated in the center and it's not blowing everywhere or gets folded up. So that's why I like these because they have this little clip on them. So yeah, just a little flag thing. I think I actually have a garden flag in here, maybe a couple of them. Um, the, the, the garden flags are like iffy sometimes they're really good sometimes they're not um so yeah we're gonna see that in this haul i'm pretty sure uh but yeah 407 for that that's a steal you guys next up is this swimsuit um i'll show it to you and then i will put a picture up of the swimsuit as well i thought it was really cute i it was 1078 i got it in a 2xl um it's so stinking cute wait till you see it I don't like to wear bathing suits, but if I'm, like, just out on the back deck, like, maybe trying to get, like, a little bit of a tan or something. But this is what, I like I said, I'll put a picture up of this, but it's got a really cute v-neck in the front. It's a one piece, but in the center you have these, like, two, these are actually kind of, like, see-through right here. This white, right, like, white, blah, 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 I can't talk, right where your waist would be. So it's going to, like, that's the smallest part of my body, so it's going to accentuate that waist. And then at the bottom of the legs, you have these really cute ruffles. And like I said, you'll see it in the picture. I'll, I'll put a picture up of it so you can see. But how adorable. And I love the print. I think there was another one that was white with this pink trim. But I got the black one. It does have um, like some cups on the inside. It's fully lined all the way down. Like the whole this whole bathing suit is lined. And it even has the little tag down here. But yeah, completely fully lined bathing suit for $10.98. And also these straps are adjustable and they crisscross in the back. So crisscross in the back. I thought it was really stinking cute. Like I absolutely love it. So I hope it fits. Um, I hope it looks decent, but it looks like it covers up the rear pretty well too. Because that's what, the one thing I worry about when I get bathing suits is, is there enough coverage in the booty area? And there is, like, there, there's a lot of coverage back there in the booty. It's not, like, high cut or, you know, I'm not going to have any cheeks showing or anything like that. Because we, no, we don't do, we don't do that. I don't do that. I can't do that. <laughs> so, yeah, for ten seventy eight, adorable bathing suit. I thought it was really cute. Hope it fits. So, we will find out. <laughs> okay, next, I just thought this was funny. I don't know why I thought this was so funny, but I love buying stickers for my... Stanley Cups. This is one I had in another haul, but I like to put stickers all over my Stanley Cups. Or, I'm sorry, dupe Stanley Cups. But I thought this was hilarious. It's a cat and it says, I will cut you. It's like a retro cat. Yeah, and it says, I will cut you. I just thought that was funny. I don't know why. It was $1.73. But it's like, oh, this little, <laughs> this cute little kitty, but I will cut you. I don't know. I don't know why I thought that was funny. I just did, so I bought it. Okay, next are these flip-flops, or I'm probably gonna not gonna really like probably wear them out. Well, maybe, I don't know. But they were only $1.99. $1.99 for these in the color pink, which they're more of like a peachy pink kind of color, I think. I mean, they're pink. They're more peachy, you know what I'm saying? Like, they're like a very more like, I would call this peach than pink. To me, this is pink. This is like a peach. But anyway, they I got them in a size, what, 36, 37, which I usually wear like a six and a half to a seven. But they have like holes in the bottom. So I thought these would be good to like wear outside on the deck or in, in the yard. Um, they look really, really comfy. They're very, very well made. But for a buck 99, like you really can't beat that. You really can't. And they had these in all different kind of colors. I think I've seen other people haul these too, but they look nice and wide. 
as well, which I kind of have wide feet. Like I have small feet, but they're like kind of wide. But yeah, they look super comfy, so I can't wait to try them out. I, I think they look great. And for a buck ninety nine, you cannot beat that. Like, absolutely cannot beat that. I mean, I've I've bought the sandals and flip flops at Dollar Tree, and they they're terrible. Like they're horrible for a dollar twenty five. But these are only a dollar ninety nine, and they're made so well. So yeah definitely recommend those okay another set of nails i bought these a bazillion a gajillion times they're two dollars and 68 cents they're like a opaly kind of pink color in a short squoval <laughs> i call it a squoval it's not quite an oval and it's not i don't know i don't know why i call it a squoval but anyways yeah i i think these are great um i bought them several times 268 for these also i will leave all the links down below if i haven't said that to all of this stuff. I'll either link to my order or link to the individual item, but yeah, I just think these are really pretty. I really like the color. It's like a, almost like an opal pink. So yeah, really pretty. $2.68 for those, can't beat that. Okay, here's where we're gonna get into the flags. So I bought these two flags and I'm gonna show you the difference between <laughs> a flag that I think is decent and a flag that Mm, not not so decent. In fact, I don't even have a price on this one. Why don't I have a price on this one? I don't know why. Okay, here's the decent one. This is the not so decent one. I, I don't remember what the price was on this. Um, if I think about it, I'll put it like down below here because maybe I got maybe I just maybe I was like I don't even care about this flag. So it's poly it's polyester. It's literally polyester. Um, it looks like this. Now, actually, looking on the screen, I'm like, okay, that doesn't look too bad. But the problem is, like, when you flip it over, yes, you can see stuff on the back, but it's, like, on the opposite side, so then it makes this whole top look dark, if that makes sense. Like, this blue is on this side on the other side. I mean, honestly, it's it's kind of cute. It's supposed to look like a patchwork type of American flag, but it's it's way polyestery. I mean, is it horrible, horrible? No. Honestly, I wish it was like a real patchwork flag because that would be like super awesome. But so this one was only 208. So I don't I will try and compare to that one, but this one is a, on a whole other level for two dollars and eight cents. It's like a burlap fabric. Let me figure out how to open this thing. Yeah, whole other level over here. So that one was completely polyester. And then this one is like burlap, okay? And it they did the same thing with this one though. So here's what this one looks like. It's much more muted. These are actually like flowers on here. But they did the same thing. They put, you know, I guess you would have to do it like that. But if you, I'm thinking if the sun's shining through this, um, it's gonna just look like a big blurry mess in a way, if you know, if you understand what I'm saying, because even me looking through it like this, it just looks like a big blurred mess. Unless, I feel like there should be like a liner in between these two pieces. You know what I'm saying? What This would actually be really cute in a frame. So would the other one really, but this one would be much more cuter in a frame, I think, than hanging outside. Only because of, I don't know, like... Let's see what happens if I can see I can see through this one a little bit too but when I like on the screen you can't tell but if you're like looking through it you know it's like a big blob or it doesn't it, none of it makes any sense because there's no like liner in between and the fabric isn't like super duper thick on either one but I don't know I don't know maybe I'm just being overly picky for two bucks right? you guys why did I do this to myself okay so this little flag was a dollar ninety five that polyester one. And guess what? I got four of them. Why? <sighs> Why did I get four of these? I don't know, but they were $1.95 a piece. Now, with that being said, the other one at two oh eight is a way better deal than these. So I don't know what my plan was with these, but I don't think they're worth $1.95. I mean, I don't know. I probably should not have bought four. Why I bought four, I have no idea. Um... I just don't know if they'll look right outside. I will, if I hang them up outside, keep an eye on my shorts. I will maybe post a short and show you what, what each one of them looks like, like outside. Because that's where I kind of need to see it. I feel like I need to see it out in the natural daylight and kind of give you an idea. So, 
there's that. I'm a little bit disappointed in that, but, you know. By the way, I also bought two sets of these. So, yeah, I bought another set for $248. But on that same note, I actually bought these as well for $248. Same nail, just a different color. This one is called, it just says Smooth Surface E405. So this one is like a baby pink with... Well, here's the difference between these two. So this one, the first one's like a mauve kind of color, and this one's like a light pink kind of color. But otherwise, pretty much the same. Really pretty. I think I got some of these for Tammy when we did our swap. I thought they were really pretty. Okay. That bag is now empty. A couple more items that are clothing, and then this. I'm pretty sure I hauled this in my last haul, only this is a different style. You guys, I've mentioned these a bazillion, gajillion times as well. $7.53, you get two pieces in here. It's two little wreaths or two candle rings or however you want to work it. I use, I literally use these everywhere. I use them in the base of candle, uh, you know, in the base of like a lantern. I use them for candle rings. I, you could, yeah, these are really nice. I can't get enough of these for $7.53 for like three something each. And like I said before for the last one, you know me, we got to zhuzh it a little bit. We got to zhuzh it out. But these are really pretty. I like the, uh, this one has the lilac in it. It's eucalyptus and lilac. The other ones just, I think, have the eucalyptus. But so pretty. Really, really pretty, really, really realistic looking, really nice. I mean, they look great up on the wall, you know, look great up on the wall. I have a couple hanging in my living room around uh, a sign in there, but I really like these with the little touch of lilac, not a whole lot, but just a little bit. But if you like a really full one, you can always double these up behind each other. Um, honestly, I think they're okay the way they are. You know, um, but yeah, you kind of have to mess with them a little bit um, if you want to get them to look like a little bit fuller. The other thing you can do is get your hair dryer out and uh, warm these up a little bit and they'll, it'll kind of wake them up. Now, don't put your dryer too close to it, obviously, but it'll kind of wake them up a little bit and make them open up a little bit more. But I think they're adorable. I love them. I use them everywhere. They're great in the spring into you know summer and throughout so yeah really pretty absolutely love these can't say enough good things about them but for 7.53 for two you cannot beat that cannot beat it okay three items to no i'm sorry yeah three items to go two clothing and one other but so we have this clothing item it's probably a tank top or i'm hoping because i need some tank tops i think it is maybe i don't know okay let's see what size we got it in I got it at 5XL. I don't know why I did that. Maybe I was thinking in case I shrunk it. Um, but I do like my tank tops like underneath to be a little bit more flowy so that they kind of flow down across my body um, and not hug my lady lumps. So this was $7.19 for this tank top. This color is called pink. It just says pink. And this was in a bunch of colors, so I probably bought a ton of these, but I like this one because it's got the v-neck in the front. I love a v-neck in the summer. I think this will be really pretty with a tan. These armholes are pretty big, and this is pretty big for a 5X. So like I said, I'm probably, it's not too polyester-y. It's stretchy. Um, it's not bad, though. It's not It's not horrible. Like, it's not bad. I, I buy tank tops all the time to wear under kimonos in the summer. But yeah, it's a real nice fabric. It's stretchy. It's a little on the heavy side. And by that, I just mean it's not like a a super thin tank top. It's It's got a little bit of weight to it, but I don't mind because guess what? I can't see through it. So that that's everything, you know? So $7.19 for that. Like it. I like it a lot. And let's see if this is the same thing, but in a different color. It probably is. So yeah, <laughs> this color though. All right, $7.19 for this one too. They're calling this magenta. Now, I usually don't wear this much color, but I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone. And you know what I need to do is, okay, I know this is super popular right now, but do you guys know anyone or any company that does color analysis? If you do, please let me know below in the comments because I would love to have a color analysis done um, to know what colors I should wear. Because I always wear like 
drab colors. So yeah, same same uh, tank top. I will put a picture up of this as well on the model, but again, I got a 5XL. Uh, this one, yeah, it's called Magenta. Ooh, look how bright that is, though. What do you guys think of this color on me? Color analysis. I like it with this hair color. I like it with that hair color kind of. It's very pretty. I love this color, actually. It looks great on camera. Very, very flowy. I love this. So which color do you guys think will look better on me? This one? We're doing our own color analysis here. Pink? Or magenta? Woo! I like them both. So, yeah. Really like both of those. Maybe if they fit right, I'll probably buy every single color. Okay, last but certainly not least, this was $8.43. I got it in the color orange, and it looks like a bouquet of flowers. We know how I am with my flowers. I buy these all the time, all the time. I love Timu's greenery. It, it needs judged, but they are roses. Oh, gosh, these are so pretty. Yeah, I got to open these up a little bit. These have thorns on them. I'm sure I bought these before. Um, I'm sure I have. But again, these need to be like zhuzhed out, but I will probably take my hair dryer to these so that they kind of open up a little bit. But I really like the look of them. Aren't they pretty? They're like super pretty. Very, very pretty and realistic looking. Really pretty. I mean, look at that. It's like a rose, right? Like these are roses. But how pretty are they? Like they need, they need smushed a little bit. But look how they have a couple that, like, aren't open. They're just, like, little buds. They're really pretty. I love these. I love these so much. So, yeah, eight forty three for those. That's kind of a lot for, like, one little thing of flowers, but really pretty. Love them. But, yeah, this is the color orange, I think. Is that what I said? Yeah. I mean, they're not really, like, super orange, but they're really pretty. Like, I feel like they look real. I feel like they look very realistic. If you had them, you know, in a vase of some kind, nobody would literally ever know that they weren't real. Maybe. Unless they went up and smelled them or asked you. But <laughs> I think they're great for 8 bucks. I mean, eight forty three. that's probably a lot. But I really like these. Like, I bought several of these. So I don't mind paying that, to be quite honest. Okay. That was everything. I'm getting a little bit heated down here. I can see I'm sweating a little bit. I'm glistening per se. Okay, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. Please subscribe if you like this kind of content. Give me a like, leave me a comment, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!